Be my eyes, Sunan. getting somewhere. This may have to match one of the doors. Strange place. Reeks of death. I wonder what secrets I will uncover here. Drag marks. And blood was shed. But only a small amount. Where are the victims still alive? Balls leave ash and footprints like these. One set larger than the rest. Sigrun and Halstein. Whoever did this, I will see that there is a price to pay. The wounds in their chests, identical, and cauterized. I've seen nothing like it. It's unnatural. Whoever was here made it a point to occupy this space.
Morale than symbols. Whatever was in this wall sat undisturbed for many ages. Until now. Asa sought to enter this vault and unlock its secrets. But before she could do so, someone beat her to it. That being led a group of Muspels here. Sigrun and Halstein were likely prisoners among them. Injured, but very much alive. The dwarves were taken to the center of this chamber, where it appears that some sort of ritual was prepared. The orchestrator came for the ancient elven object built into the wall. Possibly even used it in the ritual, as that what led to the dwarves' deaths. The Muspels then left, taking the object with them. But the purpose of this ritual of theirs remains a mystery to me. That sigil. I think I glimpsed it before in A3, while I searched for Balder. Perhaps I'll find some answers there. from the vault around here before. Find it, and I may find the culprit. Amid all this excitement, I have had little time to dwell on the Ragnarok. When will the storm break? Tomorrow, or far in the future? I think the latter. I have Loki imprisoned for whatever role he has played in Baldur's predicament. His son, too, is bound by my chain. And what of Suthor? The prophecies say he must play a part in the Reich, but for now, he's merely the abductor of my child, not the bringer of the Twilight. Still, once Baldur is safe, I will return to Asgard and raise an army. Muspelheim must be conquered, without mercy. I must be careful now. Aid me, be my eyes. Ever helm the ritual. 
ritual at the vault was once here. The culprit searches for a Jotun and a Muspel subject to complete their work. Muspels killing Muspels. Writings on the ritual. They are performed at night. There is emphasis on something called a Salakar. My elven is rusty. Vessel of souls, I think. Is this the object from the vault? The culprit was deciphering elven runes. Something about the binding of only the most powerful hookers. Sinmara. There's much secrecy about the culprit's affairs. Only she and Sutur are aware. side perhaps you're light on your feet Asa following me now you've become quite useful Aesir my gratitude for opening the vault now tell me what happened there I am following the stink as it rises as are you care to tell me why that is Days ago, Sinmara ordered my best warriors to the vault without bothering to inform me. I've not heard from them since. Well, you're casting your suspicions at the right people. Whose quarters are these? His name is Kaldir, an adept in magic. Or Seder, as you Asgardians sometimes call it. This place is where he practices it. Whatever he's doing, it is not Seder. At least not as I know it. He's using something called a Salakar. It is part of a deadly ritual. And from what this room tells me, the dead will continue to pile up. Dwarves, Jotnar, Muspels. I don't know what you're talking about. You wouldn't. Your stepmother despises and distrusts you. Your father only the latter of those. For now. But in time, thanks to her venomous whispers, he may come to hate you as much as she does. This is a lie. All of it. Your twisted attempt to pit me against them. <laughs> Sift through the mess yourself. No other truth lies within. Where are you going? After the Salakar. Whatever it is, your father needs it. It may be the only leverage I have to get my son back. Calder marked the place on a map surrounded by waters, just northeast. If he's planning another ritual there, I may be able to understand what value this Salakar holds. Calder may be near. <laughs> Lord Calder, with your permission, we will now return to Asa. Soon, I have need for you still. Asa's warriors, where do they fit into all this? You are one of our captains, yes? A duty I share with two others here. I thought I saw something in you. Stout, resolute. Step over here. Sigrun and Halstein were two of the most revered sons of evil. If such prestige is a requirement for these rituals, then Calder is surely luring that muspel. 
I wonder if there's a way I can observe the ritual up close. I need to approach Calder without him taking notice. Perhaps the best way is with deception. Come, join me, chosen one. Together, we will enact suitor's will. Who among you will hold that? the Salica! Let me kill him! Kill them! Kelda fled northwest with Asa snapping at his heels. They can't have made it far. Asa chased after Calder like a rabbit hound, though he's no helpless rabbit. What signs might I find of this pursuit? These fools dead stand in her path. Several wounds. This one put up a fight. Briefly, I suspect. Ah! Out! Damn you! bodies on this warpath. He was the last to die. Asa caught up to Calder. His warriors moved in while he pushed on. But Asa tore through them like a whirlwind. The trail of the dead reveals her direction. Calder's too. And most importantly, the Salakars. They're headed west. These two brought all the fires of Muspelheim with them. And Freya wonders why I've always refused to take her on a tour of that scorched dunghill. I need to find Calder before Azenith. 
Two sets of footprints. One is stretched, like someone fled. The other, closer together, uneven and lined with blood. They were hobbling, perhaps. Asa and Calder fought here. He gained the advantage. Foolish girl, Asa. Your rage makes you vulnerable. She's hurt, but not enough to stop her. Looks like she followed Calder up that hill. Attack on sight here. No sight of Acer or Calder. Only these curious Jutten buffoons who stand in my way. They should run, but they won't. This looks to be the source of all that noise, Moker. Leaking her lifeblood, blinded by rage and utterly reckless. <sighs> Looks to have caused her to. She came crashing in, mauling whatever half-wits stood between her and Calder. But those half-wits fought back in numbers. Injured and disarmed, she was overpowered and restrained. Calder then had her tossed onto a cart like a sack of turnips. Looks like they fled up that path. What is it Calder plans to do with the little princess now that she's his prisoner? Surely not. These tracks lead west. I must find Calder and the Salakar. For Baldur's sake. Paused here for a moment before continuing. Most likely to re-secure Asa's bonds. Even in her sorry state, I imagine her to be quite the handful. <laughs> she even bested me, temporarily. Perhaps Balder would not approve of my methods, of the cruelty I must perform on his behalf. He and Asa, they are young, pure of heart, but lacking in logic. One day they will grow up and see life as I see. In the meantime, they must rely on me to ensure they live long enough to achieve that wisdom. And so, I do not have the luxury of being faultless. They made a turn here, toward the river. I hope I'm not too late. Asa. Is that you again, mad one? Come to tempt fate, I see. I do not die this day. Can you say the same? <laughs> ah, yes. You've proven once already how you like to strut around, unencumbered by fear. Perhaps... The Salakar did not give you an adequate taste of it. Enough of this blithering. 
Hand over what is now mine, or shall I just take it? To no fear, we must be subjected to it. When I am through with you, I will take Asus, willful Uger. Soon after, the Salakar will be complete. Then, believe me, you will know fear and pain, just like your son. Such a desperate feel, man! I wish all the Asir could see you now. as guardian heir. <laughs> Much of that pretentious Asgardian air. Why is Sutur collecting hookers? What does he mean to do with the Salakar? Tell me! you care to suffer in these final moments. Do your worst. You are wasting your breath. He will not tell you. And he won't have to. His secrets are known to me now. You want them? Move aside. Move aside or I will destroy it. Traitor! Traitor? 
It is you who are slaughtering your own kind. What I do, I do for Sultar! Such devotion requires a strong Hugar. All these Muspel sacrifices, you needed only look inward. <laughs> Was he right? About you wanting to complete the Salakar? Sotor will not trade my son for something he cannot use. So you will see it through? To what end? How many lives would you take? For Balder, I would drain all nine realms. Even Asgard. The words of a dreadful king. And a selfless father. It is the one thing that separates you from my own. You wish to reunite with your son. I wish to see my father's plans lie in ruin. No matter the price. Can you see both through? I can. But I will need your help. The Salakar still requires the Hooger of a suitable Jotun. Calder never found one. I must get hunting. Do as you will. In the meantime, I'll join my stepmother, wherever she may be. I will try to learn how the Salakar fits into my father's plans. Under the guise of a contrite stepdaughter, of course. Keep it. I will need a way to find you when it is time to confront my father. You and this bauble share a bond. I set out to use you to my advantage. It ends with me in your debt. If it were not for you, I would have never known what my father was capable of. He used our people. Turned them on each other. For his gain. I cannot forgive him. And to that end, I am your ally. In Asgard, an ally is a friend. Let us not get carried away. <laughs>